to walk out to Independence Mall or to head down the shore to Ocean City Alive. Look at the boardwalk where you see some people getting in their early morning walk at workouts. Larissa, I say we take a walk over and get, get ourselves a hoagie. I'm with you, Janelle. Yeah. Sign me up. Where do we have to walk to to get ho hoagies? Independence Mall. So, yeah, that's not a short. Far, that's yeah. not far at all. <laughs> Change into my, my sneakers. Take and a stroll. Yeah, well, why not? Yeah. <laughs> well, we're going to need to dress for the weather because it's a warm one. It's going to be toasty out there. It really is. That, uh, oh, man, Janelle, you just, you just said that and I, yeah, it, it is. It's going to be warm and it's going to be a little bit muggy out there. Not anything crazy but we are tracking those dew points at the moment in the 50s and 60s and right now according to our graph here we are actually in the muggy category with more comfortable a more comfortable drier air mass north and west but later today 87 once again humidity remaining manageable for us but humidity will gradually climb as the week progresses today we're topping out in the upper 80s lots of sunshine with winds out of the southwest and speaking Speaking of humidity, this is our, these are our future dew point temperatures. And you can see how anytime we're in the 50s, that means it's comfortable. Anytime you see that number above 60, it becomes uncomfortable for you. And by Friday and Saturday, that humidity is cranking all the way up. And speaking of, while we're dry through Friday, we're going to see rain chances return for the start of the weekend. Unfortunately, it will linger into parts of our Sunday. And as of right now, neither day will will be a washout, but both days promise at least the potential of heavy rainfall. All right, Larissa, still ahead here this morning.